Um, one of the things that was unique about my traveling on this particular respite was the fact that I got to come with two of the patients that I nominated and their caregivers and families. So not only did I get to see a group of patients, but I specifically got to see my patients and their reaction to the respite. So it was really nice to see one of the women that I nominated um, to come with her mother, who was her main caregiver during treatment, although her mom wasn't able to be there a lot due to COVID. But it was just nice for them to have this, um, this person had finished her treatment and it was just a way for them to really get away and kind of put cancer behind them and sort of maybe just come together um, back to a more normal basis of their relationship, which I think was really nice. Um, and they, it, they did some things together, they did some things with the group, they did some things separately, and it was nice to be able to see that kind of ebb and flow of their time together. Um, and then it was particularly great to see a um, young man with his wife and two adolescent sons uh, to be here and to be able to do a lot of activities together. Um, I could just see how relaxed the family was, that um, my patient was, you know, involved in interacting with his kids. And that was particularly heartwarming to me because I can remember his wife telling me back in the fall how sick he was and how his younger son just kept asking, Daddy, when are you going to be well enough to just play with us? And at the time, he wasn't able to do that. And so it was great to see him over these last few days to be you know playing at the arcade and out at the pool with the kids and stuff like that so that really did my heart well to see that coming together and to be able to spend some time you know talking with them talking with his wife about uh you know what to anticipate um for you know when they get back from their trip and what their needs are going to be so um it was just a great experience and i'm glad i got to do it and i think if anything it'll encourage me to nominate more patients in the future to come on a respite with for pete's sake my name is Vicklan Seals. This is my family. My younger son, Tariq, my wife, Jillian, my other son, Tristan. Um, my favorite party at the respect was um, boat building, the escape room, and um, boat paddling. Hi, my name is Tariq Seals. My favorite part of Woodlock was going in a pool. Hi, my name is Jillian Seals. My favorite part of this respite was spending time with the family. Bingo, playing bingo for the first time and winning. <laughs> the escape room and boat paddling. Hi everyone, my name is Tristan Seals. My favorite part of Woodlock was going on the go-karts and building a boat. So it was a lot of fun memories and a lot of smiles. And I would like to say thank you for Pete's sake for sending us here to spend this time with the family, spending time with the boys, having good fun, seeing Vickla and my husband doing stuff with the boys that he could not do a couple weeks ago, a couple months ago. And even though he was really tired, he still made the effort to go with us and make the boys happy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you, Alicia, for answering the questions even though you were there for us, you gotta answer every question and tell us, you know, what is the fun activities and what not, you know, to encourage us to do stuff then together. Thank you, thank you, thank you.